Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jermaine. If you're new here, hello, stay a while. And if you're returning, what's up? Okay, so listen, this is going to be a City Pharma real vlog, okay? But I'm gonna start off in my bathroom, of course. And I'm gonna show you the products that I got the first time I went to City Pharma just as like a refresher and my review on them. And then the next portion of this video will be, hopefully, if I'm able to vlog in there, a vlog of City Pharma. With all that being said, if you are interested in skincare stuff, if you're interested in, you know, City Farmer, or if you just bored, chat, and you just want to watch, keep on watching. Okay, so the first thing I actually just thought about it: this Effaclar body wash and face wash from La Roche Posay. Literally the best stuff. I'm getting two bottles of this next time I go. I don't care. Right, and I use one pump every time I use it. That's all you need. And honestly, you could do half a pump for your face. I don't know if you watched my lifestyle haul video, but if you haven't, you should definitely check it out. But I was explaining that sometimes near my cycle, if I use that on my face, it, it dries my face out a little bit too much. So I will use Sephora, something very gentle. Other than that, that's great for daily use, like every single day on my chest because my hair sometimes um, has my chest break out a little bit and definitely on my back as well. And I've seen a huge difference so if you're looking for a face wash that needs to clear out clear up breakouts I would definitely recommend that one now let me go back I am NOT an esthetician girl okay I'm just saying what products work for me what I saw a huge change in my skin I have like combination skin sometimes it's dry sometimes it's oily it really just depends on where I'm at because I travel so much and it depends on where I'm at in my menstrual cycle as well so um so I'll be taking my advice as it's not even advice it's not even advice okay I'm just showing you the products that I purchased and things that have worked and haven't worked for me and hopefully opening up the conversation if you have been to City Pharma it is very overwhelming if you know you know <laughs> so please feel free to share the products that you have um, experience and bought and purchased and stuff like that and just let me know girl because I love to try new products okay so the next thing is this Avene cleanance mask I tried my best to keep all the boxes but some of the boxes are just way too bulky and I just had to so here is the Avene cleanance cleanance mask I just used this yesterday top notch okay top now so you put it on you leave it on for like five to ten minutes oh, let me read the box because sometimes i just be making up stuff yes five minutes okay you let it dry or you put it on dry skin so don't wash your face just put it on let it sit for five minutes and then there's these little exfoliating things in there it's not like you know like those blue gels those blue gel balls or whatever they're called like that you see in um oh what's the name of the brand it starts with a c um cleaning clearing something i'll post it on the i'll post it on the on the screen because i can't god that's gonna bother me now i'm gonna have to look that up clean and clear i think it's clean and clear you know they used to have those little blue gel things in the face wash it's not like that they're a little bit smaller and um, it's great for exfoliating. So once you leave it off for five minutes, you rub it in and exfoliate and then you rinse it off. So I just did that in the shower, put it on before I got in the shower, um, rinsed it off in the shower and then washed my face like normal. Phenomenal, like my skin was glowing, okay? So if you were looking for a quick little face mask, five minute face mask, and it does come in a tube. I've got a couple that comes in little packets, but this one comes in a tube. It is 1.6 fluid ounces, so it can go in your carry-on if you are a passenger. Because I know not all, it's not only crew members that watch this, but if you are a passenger, this will be great in your carry-on bag if you want. Okay, next is Cool and Cla. <laughs> Girl, y'all know my favorite. If you don't know, if you don't watch my vlogs, if you haven't watched the Paris vlogs, I have two of them. You should definitely go watch them. They are two of my favorite vlogs okay but french is not my best friend i promise you i am an espanol girl all the way anyway coupe de coupe coupe eclat 
It is a dark spot serum. Oh, excuse me, day cream. It's a dark spot day cream. I have been using this every single day. It comes in the jar like this. It is almost gone. And this in conjunct with the Effaclar uh, spot treatment, I started using faded topicals. I know I have makeup on right now, so you can't really tell, but my dark spots have lifted a couple shades. I wanna say at least three, okay? They used to be very, very, very dark. And using these consistently, I've seen a huge difference. Like I just, I'm so proud of me and my skin. We've come so far. I'm not where I wanna be yet. There's still some dark marks that I wanna get rid of, but I can definitely see that this has made a huge, huge difference. And I mix it with my moisturizer a lot of times because sometimes I'll be lazy. I really do. And I just like, let's put this all together. So it's a day cream. You use it during the day, okay? That's all I got for you. But it's amazing. Coup éclat. Coup éclat, okay? <laughs> Get you some. Next is the Bioderma uh, Pigment Bio Daily Care, the SPF. I actually like Trader Joe's sunscreen so i haven't used this often at all because i'm just so stuck on trader joe's and this is definitely something you have to rub in for a minute so if you watch my lifestyle haul you know that what i'm talking about the little blue tube um it is la roche posay as well i got a lot of their stuff just because i heard that hello can we can we please can we hello there we go I got a lot of their stuff because I heard the brand was just so great and honestly I do agree. Like a lot of the stuff that I've been using from them has been phenomenal. I use this jelly on my eyes after like red eye flights, after crew rest, when I've been working a lot. I really really like this gel for that. Next is the same brand. It is for dark spots. This is a tube that is pretty much gone. I think I'm all done with it. I did keep the tube just so I can show y'all but it is completely gone so that is one reason why i picked up that paris trip baby because i was like oh no i gotta go get my um my little dark spot treatment okay this really really helped my dark spots i'm telling you and i don't know if it was just the mixture of everything but i use this faithfully and like literally every single day i was not playing i was like every day y'all are getting this treatment don't play with me <laughs> roche posay did that with this one like there's nothing in there but air like nothing okay next i got their um depuffing replenishing care eye cream um this was my daily eye cream that i was using and i still love it i think i'm not done with it yet because i was also using the vici which i'll talk about in a second i love it i use that every single day there's an, it doesn't irritate my eyes at all and um yeah i would just keep saying i love it because la roche posay is the bomb like I'm a stand. I am a complete stand. Okay. Next is this Vici Mineral 89. Um, hydrates, smooths, and reduces dark circles. Okay, this one is not my favorite. It really is not, and I'm gonna tell you why. It made the under eye, I said this last time, it made the skin underneath my eyes very, very dry. Like, and I don't know if it was just too strong. I don't even know what's in it. I mean, there's no fragrance, no alcohol, so I just don't understand why. Pure caffeine and natural origin hyaluronic acid, girl, I don't know. I don't know what's in this stuff, and I don't know if I was using it, like I was just mixing to, up too many products. I have it in my skincare fridge. I was thinking about trying it for a couple days just to see but last time I tried it, y'all, it really dried the under eye area up. Like it was, it felt raw. And I was just like, ooh, this is not it. So I stopped using it. And when I stopped using it, I didn't see, like my skin healed up pretty fast. Like when I was using that CeraVe ointment to put underneath my eyes, it was bad. Like, I don't know. <laughs> y'all, I don't know. So I'm gonna try it again, maybe like for like two days and see how it goes. Does it say to like skip? It says fortifies fragile skin around the eye contour area by repairing barrier function. Reduces the appearance of dark circles, smooth, fine lines. And I don't really have like crazy fine lines. Applied morning and evening, gently massage around the eye area. See, so it says to use it twice a day and baby, I was using it once a day and my eyes were like, <laughs> girl, I don't know. I'm gonna try it twice i'm gonna give it two days and if it starts to do it again i'm throwing it out i'm sorry i can't so just be weary of the beachy stuff 
However, however, I'm not gonna throw away the whole brand because this face mask, y'all, this face mask is bomb and it wasn't even expensive at all. I got my, my sister two of these and then I had two of these. I used the first two, but I kept these. The only reason why I kept these and I haven't used them yet is because I wanted to show y'all before I use them and toss them out. So you get two in one little packet. I don't even know how much these, they, they weren't that much. They were not that expensive at all. I was like, oh wow, they smell. They smell so good. It smells like rich, rich. Okay, like, I love this stuff. And I will be getting like 10 of these next time I go. I promise. Like, I love it. So what do you do? Apply and let sit for five minutes. Then massage gently with fingertips. Rinse off with water. Use one to two times a week. Love it. Like, I, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 for Beachy with this one. Okay, so if you can find these little packets, please. Please get you some and let me know how it goes, okay? Beautiful face mask. I love this face mask. Like, it, I just, I'm big on scent and this just smelled so good. And it wasn't like overpowering perfume like smell. It was just like, oh, I feel like I'm at a spa. Like, it just smelled like I was at a spa. I loved it. I loved it. Look. So, these two deodorants, the Caudalie, is that how you say it? I feel like that's how you say it, Caudalie. The Caudalie one is okay. It kind of smells like mint, some kind of like peppermint or whatever. I'll use it back and forth between that, Sephora, and what's the third one? That banana, Hey Humans banana. Yeah, so I I just switch deodorants, whichever one I grab first. Um, there's nothing super special about it. It's just a natural deodorant. So if you want to try it, you can, but like it's, it's not like life changing or anything. Same thing with this um, girl, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know and I'm not gonna try I'm sorry I usually try y'all know I'll be trying well Lizzie watchers know I'll be trying not today though I don't even know what that says I have no idea but I don't like the smell of this I smelled it in City Pharma and I smelled it in the hotel and it was okay but now I don't like it and it's it's floral that's why it smells like not something that i would want on my skin it doesn't stink but it's just not my forte this is like a last minute you know what i'm saying oh shoot i ran out of deodorant i forgot to buy some but i have this and i'll just use it for now but it's not my favorite scent at all i'm not a floral girl and i don't know why i bought this that's not to say that this brand isn't good i just maybe i'll try a different scent in this brand just to see but like I don't know who I thought I was like and I might just give this to my sister and see if she likes it but like for me this floral whatever this is no ma'am <laughs> I'm just not a floral girl next is Noreva so this is a cream for like aftershave and stuff like that for razor bumps and stuff like that I actually have not used this yet I don't know why I haven't I think I forgot that I even had it but when I do use it, I will let y'all know. So it's supposed to help with ingrown hairs and stuff like that. I'm actually thinking about doing laser hair removal. Because I'm done with shaving. Like I started waxing and I like waxing, so I'm not shaving. The only thing I will shave is like my legs when I just don't feel like waxing because I just way too much. Shaving is like really, really quick with my legs. But I don't get ingrown hairs on my legs. So I may use this in between the laser hair removal um, appointments because they said that shaving is the only hair removal process that's accepted in between lasers laser appointments or whatever because the root of the hair has to still remain there so when they go and laser it it'll actually get the root versus you waxing and then you know you're pulling the hair out at the root so maybe I'll use that in between like my little hoo-ha area especially the bikini line so when that starts happening, I will let you guys know. And I'm very excited. So I'm going to put this out somewhere so I remember to use it when I start shaving. Okay, so next up is this Caudalie. I really hope I'm saying that right. Caudalie, Caudalie, Caudalie. Moisturizing, mattifying fluid. Okay, Lord have mercy. So this is moisturizer before you put on your makeup. For me, personally. I've been using that. 
and it's almost gone so I wanted to stop using it because I didn't know when I was going back to Paris and I was like well let me just hold on to the last little bit I have I'll definitely be buying more of this Caudalie is the bomb like I see why the girls like it okay because it is fire <laughs> fire okay and then this one is the blemish control salicylic serum um it's and I totally forgot I had this you know what I think I stopped using this too because I was like, I don't know when I'm going to go back to Paris. I need to savor it, okay? Um, but I'm going to put this back in my routine because, baby, I was using this every day um, and it's like halfway gone. So, I love both of these. And I think this came in a set, if I'm not mistaken. I'm trying to remember if it was these two or these two. I feel like it was these two because they're both Vino Pure. Vino Pure. Vino Pure? Yeah. Be up here. Yeah, so these came together in a little packet or a box or whatever. So, love these, love these, love these, love these. If you're looking for something to go under your makeup or you're looking for like a um, serum to help with breakouts and acne, get that serum, girl. Next, me, me. Yeah, it's, 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 it was an unnecessary buy, in my opinion. This is the Beauty Elixir Smoothing Glowing Complexion from Caudalie. As you can see, I haven't used all of it. Um, it's okay. I, do I need a Beauty Elixir? I don't feel like I do, honestly. I just bought it because I was like, ooh, what's this? <laughs> so if you are into elixirs and stuff like that, it smells very fresh, very minty, very pepperminty kind of smell. Um, if that's something that you like and you like spraying your face and being refreshed and all that stuff, girl, half the time I be forgetting that this is even in my bag, okay? Because I don't be thinking, especially at work, I don't be thinking about stuff like that. But if you are that kind of girl, I would recommend it because it makes your skin feel very <clears throat> moisturized, I would say, but like fresh, like a refresh. So if you like that kind of refresh during the day and you just want to and be bougie, girl, get you some. Get you some, girl. Caudalie is the bomb, okay? Okay, last but not least is the hand and nail repairing cream. I threw this in my bag. Every time I use it, it's fine. There's no greasy, girl. There's no greasy um, after effect or anything like that. Um, I really like it. It smells fine. It's just normal hand lotion, but it's a little bit thicker. And um, yeah, that's all I really have to say about that one. If you want to buy it you can it's not that <laughs> i think i had some bioderma hand cream it's somewhere in my bag i'm sorry because this video is getting kind of long and it wasn't supposed to be this long but um the hand cream from bioderma the little small one that i got phenomenal i really really like that one i use that one all the time it's in my lunch tote and girl let me tell you something if it makes it to my lunch tote as a top pocket it's the bomb okay that means i use it consistently like all the time so i would definitely be getting it you know what let me stop let me go get it. <laughs> this cream here, <laughs> this hand cream from Bioderma, bomb, okay? Look, look, that's how you know. Almost gone, love it. And I will be getting the bigger version if they have it. Oh, also, just realized, I have this um, moisturizing micellar water makeup remover. I haven't used this one yet because I wanted to finish the Belief um, cleansing balm that i have in there which i love so much like you literally put it on and it wipes straight off belief y'all did that okay y'all did that for real but this was just like a backup um just to have when i run out of that so i haven't used it yet but i will um and then the last thing i think i got from city pharma as well was this la roche posay micellar water as well and as y'all can see girl she's halfway gone I love this stuff too. I love this stuff. I hope they have a balm though, because between the liquid and the balm, I think I'm a balm girl. I do. Because it's just so much, it's greasier, but not like real grease, you know what I'm saying? But the, the texture and the consistency of it, I really like to use that to get the makeup off versus using the liquid, because the liquid is just a little bit harder to deal with. Um, and I don't like putting the liquid on a cotton pad and wiping it off because I just feel like that like really irritates my face. So I think I'm a bomb girl. I think I am. So anyway, those are the products. I know there's probably a little bit more, especially the stuff I got from my mom. I'm going to have to ask her, you know, if she likes the soaps and stuff like that. Um, I feel like I'm missing something. If I am missing something, I will just go back 
review the um, City Farmer Hall thing and then give you guys an update a little bit later in the video. But I hope y'all enjoyed this review and let's get to City Farmer. <laughs> My camera definitely died. I got like maybe three minutes of good footage before I had to start using my phone. So since the very top layer is all baby stuff, first of all, this is amazing because this is usually like shoulder to shoulder. Like, so this was a great time. Me and my coworker got here at 12.15. Um, they opened up at 12. So that's one reason why I didn't have time and I totally forgot about my camera. I could have charged it on the flight, but um, yeah, so. It's very, very empty in here, which is chef's kiss. So since the top layer is baby stuff, I'm gonna start from the third layer down. So this is all mouthwash, dental stuff. And as y'all, if y'all see my last city from a haul, I did buy some Marvis and I actually really liked it. And I liked it because it was small enough to take on my trips. So I'm gonna grab a couple of those. It's green, emergency. And use mint. Okay, so I'll get, I thought she said Jermaine, I was like, huh? <laughs> Don't know me up in here. Smoker's whitening mint. That's not that deep. So I do like the ginger mint, even though it didn't taste like ginger whatsoever. Um, I will get aquatic mint. And I will get, did I get whitening? No. I will get the regular whitening mint. So I'll get three of those. 
Um, I'm waiting to bump into my coworker. I wonder if he wants to be in the vlog. <laughs> Um, and there's mouthwash over here. I think the last time I got mouthwash out of here, it was, I think it was something like this one. Um, it was okay. It was nothing crazy. Um, so I'm going to skip the mouthwash this time. What else did I need from up here? And y'all, can I tell you that I left the freaking list that I made? It was a beautiful little list. It had the stuff that I wanted. It had the stuff that... It had the stuff that I wanted. It had the stuff that my sister and my mom wanted. And I was just like, oh. So on our way to the hotel from the airport, I tried to make a list again. So hopefully I can get everything. The hardest the hardest um, level to this, in my opinion, is the very first level, which I didn't get a lot because it was very, very packed down there. And that's all the skincare girl. So I'm gonna vlog and like have y'all look up, but there's so many different brands. Everything is in French, so I have to use my phone, which really sucks because my camera's dead. So I could have been vlogging with my camera and using my phone to Google Translate, but whatever. Gotta make it work because I promised y'all a City Pharma vlog. Okay, I really did. I really, really did. So I think I'm all done up here in the um, tooth stuff. I want some gum, chewing gum. Why not? <laughs> why not? So over here is like the protein. I don't know why I wasn't doing this before, but um, the camera in the front, the front camera really sucks. I don't know. It's going. It's as clear as it's gonna get. I'm sorry if the quality. I'm sorry if the quality is poo poo, but my camera is dead, bro. Anyway, here is like protein stuff. Okay. As you can see, all of this is just like protein bars and stuff like that. And my list is on my phone too, so it's kind of hard to vlog and look at the list. But like, I got honey from Australia, so I'm good on the honey for a minute. I got three things of honey. Ridiculous. But I was obsessed. I was like, oh, I need all this honey. Oh, tea. Okay. So here's the cute little tea section. There's literally everything in here. Like everything, everything, everything. Water drop micro drink. What is this? is this i wonder if this is like those mio things but just in tablet form i don't know i'm not really into stuff like that so but i did want some more peppermint tea that's what i wanted peppermint tea so they have loose leaf stuff here lavender hibiscus um oh maybe i should get some and these are three dollars y'all three euro so that's i mean it's probably close to the same amount should i get hibiscus <laughs> It's like I'm picking stuff up and putting it back. And then, I know y'all saw that elevator. Like, come on. And yes, the baby hairs are there, baby. Don't play with her. <laughs> Don't play. So here's mint. Mint. Should I just get this? Because I don't want to get... There's time. Okay, I'll try that. Oh, and then you get this cute little tote. You don't have to pick it up i highly suggest you get one <laughs> highly so over here is all like the gummies and um like dieting stuff um this is starting to be like um colds and um stuff for like health health stuff so i don't know what any of this is all oh, this is a french girl i don't know Oh, jojoba oil, macadamia oil. Oh, are these all oils? Oh, essential. So essential oils. Girl, we getting somewhere. Essential oils. Lemongrass. Oh my god, they're like twenty dollars. Twenty dollars for a little vial. That's like no, it's real. It's real. It's not for fake. So there's like immune stuff. There's um, all the vitamins and stuff like that. I don't really need any of this stuff. I'm just showing you guys. Um, here's like menopause and like women's health stuff, which is really dope. Um, and there's just like all vitamins. It's all like health stuff up here, which I think is really cool. Um, I don't know what most of this stuff is. A lot of it says menopause, so I think I'm in the wrong area. <laughs> Let me go downstairs. <laughs> so this is to the outside. Oh no, what is that? I think that's the um, upper level. So there's so many different ways you can get upstairs and downstairs because it's like four or five levels. So we're gonna take the lift. <laughs> Wait, where are we at? Oh, 
we're on one. Okay, so we need to go down to zero. I'm so happy I can get this footage for you guys because like I felt so bad last time. I was so over girl, my necklace is all over the place, Jeff. I was so overwhelmed last time, y'all. I was like, oh my god, I feel so bad. Like we were supposed to kiki key, key, key. We were supposed to have a good time. Okay. So all of this stuff got a wall full of masks, of course. And then it goes into hair products. Over here, and then little trial and travel things, which I really wanted another Bioderma. Yes, two more of these because I really like these. Um, but yeah, that's all the trial and travel stuff, and then SPF stuff. Um, and this is where it gets crazy, y'all. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at all of that. Look at all of that. Like, there's stuff everywhere. There's a lot of, like, um, value packs. Everything is very narrow. And this is the busiest part of the store because this is where all the good stuff is. So. Um, and then this is the little men's section right here. And then right over there is the door that I came in at. So there's security there. He checks your bag, just looks inside. Honestly, he doesn't really mess with anybody. He was here last time I came. Um, so yeah. And then they have a huge Caudalie wall, which is so pretty. We'll be going over there in a second. Oh, my coworker said he wanted some more of this. Um, and then they have all these oils and stuff apparently this is like a famous oil or something like that i smelled this one in the airport and it was not my cup of tea like i just so i don't know um y'all it's huge down here they have all these brands a lot of this stuff i don't even know um they have a is it lakatan Lakaton wall and like this stuff is discounted for a reason so they have skin suticles like all of it is discounted except for that channel is um, but that's why everybody comes to City Pharma because it's all discounted at a really really good, good price and then you get your taxes back as well if you do not live here so like as you can see this could be very overwhelming like y'all the last time I was here I saw a lady with an excel spreadsheet on her phone with items and I was like she not playing with y'all so a couple of that so all kinds of stuff like all kinds of stuff so like I couldn't get over the spreadsheet. I was like, yo, she's a genius, number one. She's a genius. Okay. This is where they had the face masks last time. I don't see the ones that, oh, there they go. So these are the ones that I had that I really, really liked. Um, and then they're $1.99 each. And it's a Korean beauty one. Yeah, baby, we don't play. So I'm gonna get a couple of, I'm gonna get a couple of these, some for me, some for my sister. And um, do some shopping and I will catch up with you guys in a second. Like, y'all, look at these prices. For the big one. Like the big one, okay? Isn't that usually the price for the small one? In Sephora. I wanted to get a conditioner, but I just don't know which one to get. There's so many different kinds. Okay, y'all, so here is my bag so far. Oh my gosh. I think this is more than what I spent last time. I think it's a lot. <laughs> I think it's a lot. But yeah, that's about it, guys. Like, this is all the oil and stuff like that. Um, and then oils. And yeah, I did want some bar soap, but all these are so tiny. 
Like, what am I gonna do with this? That'll be done in like not even a month. They're so small. So I think it was cute to like give my mom and stuff like that, just so she can try different stuff and just have cute little stuff from France. But um, <laughs> yeah, I think I'm all done. I'm gonna double check my list and we should be all done. I really hope I got some good footage. My coworker's so sweet. I think he got some footage of me shopping on his phone, which was really cute. Um, but literally, my phone has been dead. So. It's been in my pocket, y'all, y'all, y'all. Like, I need y'all to see this. Like, this is my charger, okay? And it's been in my front pocket, charging. Looking foolish, but like, I can't have a dead phone in Paris, okay? So, with that being said, I gotta go, bye. Y'all, look, so before, I'm so glad I came back over here because before all of this was out, and now they have the double pack for $23, which is amazing. And I want to say it's actually $21. Yeah, because this one's this one is the micro peeling imperfection. So that's $23. So this one, the one that I'm getting, the one that I showed you guys that I love, is $21 for two of them, which is amazing because I literally use half a pump of this a day, so it's gonna last for forever. <laughs> yes, do I? <laughs> this is video. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what this says. Pinch, go to camera. I'm trying to find a moisturizer for my mama. Where is it? Oh, I had an English to fridge. It's supposed to be. I was like, it's not doing nothing. Switch, switch, switch. Switch to English. There we go. Oof, job. One moment for real. Oil free cream. <gasps> you did. Just it. what she wanted. You did it. That's crazy. UV filters with sunscreen. It's literally in my hand. That is insane. And it's $20. I know that's right. Because this looks big. Aw, yay. Clarifying facial treatment with goat's milk, tea tree oil, and goat's tea cola. The power of flawless skin. <laughs> okay. Hey y'all, so of course I'm in the airport on standby, girl. All bundled up like a burrito, cause y'all ain't finna see my uniform. I hope y'all enjoyed this City Pharma vlog. When I was editing, I was like, dang, I should have got better footage, like as far as how I shot the footage, but girl, we're we gonna get better with time, okay? But I hope y'all enjoyed. If y'all have any pointers, any tips, or any questions about City Pharma, please let me know. I'm not a professional, but I've been twice, so um, I'll try my best to answer your questions. And if you end up going to City Pharma, please tag me in the pictures. Let me know how was your experience. Let's chit chat, okay? Okay, in the next clip, I'm just gonna voice over the products that I got, so stay tuned, and thank you all so much for watching. Hey guys, so I am in the airport actually recording this, so I hope that y'all don't hear any boarding announcements in the background, but welcome to the cute little city from a hall number two, okay? So let's start with the stuff I got from my mom. I got her this Hyaluronic B5 um, eye cream. I heard it's top notch. I also got her a day cream, like a moisturizer with SPF in it that she wanted. Then I also got her a gentle cleanser. It came in a two pack and I wanted to try this as well. Um, so one for me and one for her mm -hmm. and then for my sister I got her this almond milk cleansing um, <laughs> cleansing almond milk um, it's supposed to get rid of makeup and stuff like that I also got her a green green clay can I speak today green clay face mask a honey mask and an aloe mask these are all moisturizing because that's something um, that she wanted also got her my favorite mask personally and then some Korean beauty masks uh, which I've tried already and I love so so much so I got her a couple of those then I got her this mineral 89 serum which I heard was amazing for your skin so hopefully she enjoys this I actually got from duty free um, I heard this advanced night repair is phenomenal and I've been trying it for about a week and a half 
phenomenal 10 out of 10 as well as this niacinamide like y'all this smells so good and it makes my skin so freaking soft oh my gosh paired with this bioderma um night cream it's supposed to brighten the skin in dark spots y'all i have seen a huge difference in my skin i cannot wait till the next week's vlog so y'all can see what i'm talking about bioderma hand lotions top notch 10 out of 10 love their brand it's not greasy it's just so moisturizing then i got three different um toothpaste i like like i said i like these toothpaste because of the size and they taste fine like i said that ginger one don't taste like ginger girl so don't be expecting that <laughs> then i got my favorite eye cream just an extra one since i ran out i also got a new um dark spot corrector this is actually the big tube i didn't see the big tube last time or maybe i didn't want to buy it but i love it so i'm glad they had the big tube this time and then this is just the same face mask that i got my sister i just got two of each so i can try one this new brand of course i had to get my vichy girl and my k beauty okay <laughs> and then ooh, this peppermint tea is so freaking good i've literally drank it at least once every single day <laughs> As much as I can then I got the cleansing milk as well just because I just wanted to see how well it takes my makeup off I do love this line that they have the vino clean vino clean so I tried the toner been using it every day and I love it also this mask y'all mask the raving I didn't know that people were raving about it on TikTok until I overheard somebody in the store but like it is worth it like I love it and then the baddie the baddie I was able to get two of those very happy about that I also wanted to try the foaming cleanser. I haven't tried it yet, so once I do, I will let you guys know. And then this is the second um, gel thing that came in there. I wanted to try a gentle cleanser as well. Oh my God, <laughs> sorry about that. Because um, my skin is a little bit more sensitive during my cycle. So I'll let you guys know how that goes. But this is everything that I got for my ladies. And thank you all so much for watching. Bye. But I could never write my